along with helping you color the uh, PCB panel so it looks like the final product, one of the new features in Blueprint 5.1 is actually air checking when adding mill taps. If I was to add a mill tab here to this web route, I can set parameters in the milling manager on how far I want the mill tab to be to specific features on my panel. Whether that be components, copper, drills. You can even set keep in and keep out areas here and uh, have it uh, show me if I'm too close or inside of a keep out area. Or I can set an area that the mill tab must be placed in as a keep in area. Once these parameters are set up, as you uh, work with your mill tabs, you have two choices. You can set it up as a warning where it will tell you if it violates one of the rules, or you can actually have it prevent the errors as you're placing the mill tabs. If I pick up this mill tab here and move it close to this component here, you can actually see where I get an error marker telling me that it's violating one of those rules. Now I'm going to place a uh, keep out area and show you how that works. Just going to choose a rectangle here and just arbitrarily place a, the rectangle on my web route here and then I'm going to uh, format that rectangle and format it as a uh, keep out area. And then as you might expect, if I bring the mill tab into that area, you get an error uh, indicator. I can set this color to be a different color so that the red error indicator um, shows better as well. Another new feature is the ability to associate uh, mill tabs to each other. So if I was to drop down another mill tab, say over here, I can now combine these two in, essentially into a one mill tab by saying uh, associate and then selecting this other one. And now that they're associated, when I move one, as you imagine, the other one moves as well. And one of the last new features here in Blueprint uh, 5.1 is the ability to move these uh, in unison by just simply typing in a new dimension. Since I do have the one selected, I'm going to come up here and type in a new dimension. And they both move automatically. So again, in Blueprint 5.1, we have the ability to place mill tabs in their proper locations, do error checking, associate one mill tab to another, and move them as a pair.